Hi there, my name's Amy from Email Signature Rescue. Today I'm going to show you how to set up a HTML email signature using Postbox. Okay, Postbox is actually one of the easier ones to set up, so this shouldn't take too long. Uh, okay, so first we're going to head up to the Tools menu, and then we're going to click Options. This is going to open up this Options uh, panel here. Now, we're in the Accounts tab, and we're going to see a list of all of our accounts that we have set up. I only have amy at divparty.com.au set up, so I'm just going to go ahead and click on that. Now, immediately below the, the uh, account that you want to add your email signature to, you're going to see Identity. Click on that one. Now, under the Identity uh, tab, we see Signature, and we see None. Or if you have set up a previous email signature, you might see the name of the um, signature that you set up. And we've got an edit button right here next to that. Now there's another one below it, but we're going to click the top one. So click edit, and that brings up a signature window. Now uh, we're going to give our signature a name. Okay, and now we're actually going to head over to our email signature rescue dashboard to download the HTML file that we need to uh, to insert into this signature. So. We're just, just going to head over there now. Okay, now this is the one that I want to set up in, in uh, Postbox. So I'm going to download this one. And here it is. So I'm just going to actually open it up in Notepad. So I'm going to right click on it. And I'm going to say Open with Notepad. Now if you're on a Mac, you might open it with uh, Text Edit or another um, uh, HTML reading software so um, okay but on PC it's in notepad now uh, we're going to go ahead and select all the uh, the code here now we're not going to use our mouse to select it like that we're actually going to use the control a button to select all of that text so that we don't miss out any of, the, of any of the uh, vital code that we need uh, if you're on a Mac, it's Command A to grab all of that. And then we're going to Control C to copy that text. If you're on a Mac, it's Command C. And then we're going to head back to our uh, post box. Okay, so we've clicked into this signature uh, box right here. We'll just click in. And then see this little paper icon? If you hover on it, it says HTML. We need to click that. Okay, that opens another window and it says insert HTML, uh, HTML, enter HTML tags and text. Now click into that box and you're going to control V. Now that has copied uh, all of that code from the email signature HTML to uh, this box here. Okay, so we're going to insert and look, there it is. There's the HTML email signature right there. We're going to OK that and OK that. Now when we go to create a, a new message, there's our HTML email signature attached. Now um, you might be wondering why there's boxes all around um, all of the text. Don't worry about it. Um, it's how Postbox sets out the email signature when you're creating it. It's not how the receiver will receive the email signature. It will be nice and clean when the receiver receives it. OK. So that's how you set up an email signature on Postbox. Uh, I hope this has been informative. If you need any more uh, help, head over to emailsignaturerescue.com.